Happy days for Delhi. I mean, this was a huge game. After all that happened, it could have just been a sinking feeling in the camp and this result not gone their way, but a convincing win just for the doctor order. Yeah, and uh, you know, a team that had beaten them uh, previously quite convincingly in uh, Kolkata. So, yeah, perfect day for Delhi. Couldn't do anything wrong uh, with the bat. Uh, set it up beautifully with uh, Prithvi Shaw and Munro at the start. Mm. You know, that, that start was critical. They needed, uh, you know, they didn't really need to lose that early wicket. Once they got that, they made sure through the course of the innings, they batted in the same, sure. so at the same tempo and uh, Shreyas finished it really well. From then on, it was about bowlers keeping the head. So, yeah, perfect night for Delhi. In a way, that it was important that they continued getting the runs or uh, continued, you know, uh, just make sure they get over 200, 215. Because yeah. when Andre Russell kicked off in the 14th over or so, you, if it was 170, 180 and they fizzled out in the first innings, could have made a huge difference. So important that Delhi and Shreyas had kept going till the end. That's the thing. It was either Russell or nobody, really, which is which is how it worked to get to get those runs. So, mm. but yeah, the, you're right. The great thing about the Delhi innings was they just they had the foot on the yeah. on the gas throughout on the gas the whole yeah. time. You know, there was no let up. So that's that's a great innings, and they should celebrate well tonight. That's they, they deserve that. Yeah, it's an all round uh, batting effort as well. Got uh, got him. If you look at. Uh, everyone together, 62 from Prithvi Shaw, 33, Munro, even 27, Maxwell, with the exception of Rishabh Pant, who's got run previously. That's uh, quite a few boxes ticked for Delhi now. Definitely, and the, I think the wicket also suited this kind of style of play, and they're all good uh, hitters of the ball, aggressive players. If you see, only Ayer uh, is the kind of guy whom you would look to bat through the innings, mm. but he was also the aggressor today. So, uh, I think they would like these kind of wickets uh, at least for the next six home games or five home games which they have. Mm. So, uh, it's a great start, good positive signs and uh, who knows what can happen. Oh yeah, on a side note, you must be very pleased today for Prithvi Shaw and Shreyas Iyer together putting the performance and I'm sure well, you well, expect When the Mumbai guys turn <laughs> up, it's just, that's what and happens. And that too at <laughs> Delhi, always, <laughs> no, always nice. No, yeah, I mean for an 18, 19 year old to play you know, with that much confidence, had a nice little, little innings in the previous game yes. as well. Uh, but just to carry on this time, and there's some quality bowlers in the opposition. When you're facing a Mitch Johnson, maybe not, not at, uh, sure. not at his peak or not at his <laughs> best. What still a very, still very good right. bowler, and so much <laughs> reputation that you're facing him as well. And not just reputation, still a good bowler. Yeah. Uh, there's a Sunil Narayan, mm. uh, Piyush Chawla has been in good form. Andre Russell, you know, still coming and hitting the deck hard. For a young player, must be very satisfying. It gives you a sense of belonging also. I mean, even if you're hitting Mitchell Johnson three or four years past his prime, flicking him over mid-wicket for six and playing this kind of innings, I'm sure you spend a lot of time with Rajasthan, you saw Sanju Samson and the likes, you know, grow up to things like this. It could, it could change the way a young Indian batsman plays in the IPL. There's no doubt, you know, when he wakes up in the morning, he's going to be a different, in his mind, he's a different cricketer. and In people's mind, he will be as well. And hmm. both, both those, you know, you know Prithvi Shaw, um, Shriyas, um, you know, they're, they're going to wake up a more confident cricket player, that's for sure. There's going to be a bit more of a swagger about them tomorrow morning. I mean, there's, and that's the thing about IPL. Or even India A tours these days, or under 19s, you know, which mm. uh, Rahul's been around over the last couple of seasons. The exposure that the kids are getting these days, yes. you can see a lot more confident bunch when they come into this sort of uh, situation. Uh, helps them adapt a lot quicker than maybe it was the case about 15, 20 years back.